Hey, oh God, this is crazy. Hello everybody, I'm moving out of my princess pink girly beauty room. I just filmed a room tour because, you know, I cleaned it all up, got it all to how it was, filmed the room tour because I'm about to tackle it and get rid of it all. Because I have so much stuff and all of this cannot come in 2024 with me. But this is just the beginning, you guys are going to come along the journey with me of packing everything up, downsizing, moving out. <laughs> carrying things up and setting up my new room until I'm fully moved in. But today is Thursday, the 4th of January, and I hope to be fully out by Tuesday next week. <sighs> anyway, you guys, this isn't just going to be a vlog of like me doing packing things. This is kind of also just like, focus. kind of also like a hangout with me. Hang out with me for the weekend. Right now I'm actually... You can't even tell, but I'm like really pale. Like I'm not tan. Usually I tan every week, but I'm tan in like three weeks. I don't know if you can tell, but you can. Trust me, you just can't tell in the way to go. And my hair is also like not toned or anything. So tomorrow, I think, I'm going to tan, do my hair, tone it, wash it, have the shower, you know what I mean? Get all prettied up. I feel like myself again. I honestly think, I don't know whether I should do two trips Okay, so I'm moving to the town across, okay? I'm moving to the town across from me. I was literally going to move to the Gold Coast. I had a place and everything. I was literally about to move in a week. Like, it was insane. I was planning to pack up my car. I was already talking to my family about meeting them halfway. Because I was going to drive and bring my car with me. It's 18 hour drive. So I was going to drive like 9 hours and then 9 hours. But, literally... I, like, one night was, like, really stressed out, right? Like, my thoughts were really getting to me. And I put on some worship music. And I just, like, hopped up in my bed. And literally just started, like, worshipping God. And just, like, praying. And, like, just singing these songs, right? Anyway, I was literally worshipping. And I was like, God, if you want me, if you don't want me to move, you need to do something. You need to do something. You need to change something in me. You need to change something that I feel. You need to do something like, miraculous if you don't want me to leave. And I was just like, God, if this is like not your will for my life right now, like if you want me to stay here. And like little things made me feel like, oh, I should be here. That I feel like, you know, I need to be here for that. Yeah, just giving it all to God like that. The way I just put it all, gave it all to him. God just blessed me. Guys, literally the next morning, I woke up with a completely different mindset. Legit, the next morning I woke up and I was like, oh my gosh, okay, like, maybe I stay here for a little bit longer. You know, move in with my friend for a couple months. I have a friend that lives in the town across. Maybe I should just stay with her and move there and just, you know, give that town a go. Because I was kind of just like, no, I want to move to the Gold Coast only. Like, ah! And I never really gave it a good shot. Moral of the story. And so I was like, okay, like I'll consider it. So then I went to dad's work and I sent out five resumes. Five resumes. Literally within 45 minutes, someone calls me back and offers me something that I didn't even apply for. Literally just my dream, my dream job. Guys, God is good. He knows the desires of your heart. And I feel like it was just such a miracle. It just immediately, I knew it was a God thing. I'm really excited and my whole mindset's changed. Like I really didn't want to move there. I was like, not like this is too close to my hometown like I just like I don't know, I have bad memories here I just don't want to be here I'd rather just I feel like I'm just such more of a city girl right there's more to do more people that do what I do now now I'm like so excited I'm so excited to move here I'm so excited to be close to my family it's like I just feel like this is gonna turn into my safe place which is insane because it used to just be like my trauma down but yeah I'm so excited and right now I'm just going to edit a room tour on my Mac that I just I finished my dream board for 2024. Look at it. I did this in the form of a phone as well. So I also have it as my wallpaper on my phone as well. Ta-da! Here we are. These are the best. My mom makes literally the best ones ever. Ta-da! Literally look how good. Okay, they don't look nearly as good as they are in real life. Mm-mm-mm. mm mm I... I think I'm gonna take some pictures of some things in my room that I want to sell. Put some stuff up in the marketplace. Now that the room tour is filmed, what am I waiting for? It's honestly kind of emotional. Now that I'm leaving and I like, I don't know that I'm not gonna be back. You know what I mean? Because I'm 21. Like, 
in saying that. I know people move back at different ages, but I feel like, you know, like, what if me leaving, like, is the last time? You know, I want to finish eating these. <laughs> so you guys don't just keep seeing these get shut in my mouth. They are just so good. Okay, so it is Friday. And so far, all I've done is I've gone through all these like makeup things and got rid of a bunch of stuff i'm just gonna give it to my sister and my friend and now what i want to do is i'm gonna pack these two suitcases filled with all my clothes from in there and in here i'm gonna try to squish them all into here let's see how we go <laughs> okay that is everything in there but i still have my t-shirts and all of that stuff okay let's try zip this up Okay, I just emptied those coat hangers into this bag and everything in those boxes and now into that bag. And now I'm filling the suitcase with all my products and I'm going through these products and then all the products are going to be in there. Wow, okay, so that's already packed and I still have all of this to go. All of this and everything in here. Slay. I just put on a fake tan, so I'm nice and tan. All of these done. I think I'm getting rid of those three. Got rid of all those. It's a bucket of my stuff. Still have to go through that stuff. But I feel like I'm like nearly done. Okay, I'm definitely not nearly done, but I've gone through most of my room and got rid of the stuff that I don't need, I think. I still have a couple more things to do in that regards. But I just FaceTime my friend Emma. She's gonna help me move all my stuff up the three flights of stairs. I love her. She's such a good friend. But now it's hustle time. It's like the final stretch. I just finished and like I went to go meet this lady because I'm babysitting her kids on Monday. So I'm driving back here to do that. But I just went and met her. So now I'm back. I have nothing else to do except for pack up my car. I don't think you can see, but it is 1.12 and I want to get there around 5, 5.30. So it's a little bit cooler to start unpacking everything which means i have to leave at 4 30 which means i have about four hours to pack up my car and sort through everything so it is hustle time let's do this this is my fit check <laughs> it's really cute oversized tea i got one on some brizzy and then this is what we've got going on in the lounge room this is my suitcase of some of my clothes some more of my clothes clothes i'm getting rid of this is insane let's make a coffee Yum, yum, yum. Exactly what I needed. Let's do this. Let's stop putting this stuff in the car. Ah! It's about to be so hot. Okie dog. I've finished. I'm coming back on another day to get all the rest. Amazing. Time to go. <laughs> Look at Cassie. She's like, what? Why are you still going? I'm not going anyway. No, it's just Sam leaving. Again. This side, what's going to fit? What? Is it the length of the walls? Is it butt? <laughs> She's like, Sam, what are you doing? Look at her mum. Oh, oh, she just her put her... <laughs> oh, this is so cute. This is my little baby saying, don't leave. Mm. You're so cute. Mm. <laughs> All right, pass the baby to me. You see Sam. She'll be back soon. All right, this is literally stacked to the broom. Okay, well, I need to be able to see at the back, so I didn't stack it there. My front seat next to me is stacked. My boot stacked. Let's, let's go. I don't know if you guys can see me, but I'm literally bawling my eyes out in the car listening to worship music because God has just been so good to me. And my mum was literally saying that, and then I literally hopped in the car and started my drive. And a song came on that was just like talking about how God leaves the 99 for the one and how he will completely like keep chasing after you. And it was just like, bruh, I'm crying in the car right now. Everything's unpacked. <laughs> Emma set it all up. Emma came <laughs> over. She's outside the room, but. Hey, that's tomorrow's job. But look at the bed. Emma found out a perfect way to put the bed and it looks amazing. And look how many products I have. I did not realize that this is a joke. And if you think these are all full, just <laughs> <laughs> oh. exposing me. Literally all of these have like probably 0.3 centimeters worth of tan in it. <laughs> okay, that is empty. <laughs> Hi guys. 
I am in bed now in my new room. My parents are coming tomorrow to like drop off more stuff. Oh my gosh, it's been such a big day. I am so ready for bed. But I will talk to you more in the morning and update you a little bit more on the plan. I think I'm just gonna chill in bed for a bit and do some editing. And then I also need to write a list on like what stuff I need to get from Kmart tomorrow. I need to get some baskets for my clothes. I need to get a laundry basket, a bath mat, and just some cute like baskets or something to put like like stuff in, in the bathroom. Or oh, and drawers for the bathroom because I've just got too much stuff as you saw. Come in my Udi. Come in my Udi. <laughs> Eliana, try to put him in. <laughs> I carry him and you stand up and open it. Come um, first. I think he might be too fat. <laughs> <laughs> you got a wiggler. Come in here. Come in here. Mommy's torturing him. Wait, stay there, Molly. Wait, wait. Oh. See, this is the end. You can come through this way. <laughs> Do you see? The <laughs> He's through. You have to carry him. <laughs> Naomi's cooking for a guy. I'm gonna show what you're making. Okay, we've got some sausages, some pork sausages. Mm -hmm. Potatoes are boiling for a mash. We've got some broccolini and the lamb cutlets. <laughs> He's the luckiest man ever. Hey, Milo. Milo's like, bitch, no, that's me. That's me. We've got a little candle lit for the hours. Okay, I, I did that, but you gotta have some atmosphere. <laughs> You come on the side. And my room is a mess because I had a job interview today. We are getting there. Got a bedside table yesterday. This is it. So cute. Picked up like the last of the stuff from my house. Hey Milo. Milo's already done three peas and one poo in this room. Haven't you Milo? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. You have, haven't you? <laughs> yeah. Tonight I'm just editing this vlog. Gonna film some ASMR and start getting into routine. And I start my job tomorrow. <laughs> some live ASMR. All right, let's turn Lucinda off for this date. <laughs> How do I do this remote? I'll just turn the TV off so it doesn't look set up. Oh, yes I did, yes I did. <laughs> I'm going to go. Can't you hear that? Boom, 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 Alright you guys, shopping haul time. I went to Kmart and got some stuff for my room, just some like essentials. And I'm going to show you right now. So I got two European pillows and I got like in the like the light grey colour. It was between this one and like a really dark grey. But I put this one next to like something in the shop that was similar to that pink. And this looks way better. So I got two of those because I have... European pillows that is in my cupboard like shoved in there and I think that European pillows look so good I know make a bed look really packed and comfy like a marshmallow so got two of those I got a like a makeup makeup holder thing to like hold my makeup palettes I got just some more um, setting powder because I was running out I got this like really cute soap dispenser I wasn't sure like about the color because like I don't have anything in my room that color, but I just like couldn't stop looking at it. I was like looking at all the different dispensers. I'm like, mm, and this is just so unique. I just had to get it, and of course I had to get the matching little, you know, shizzle. Then I got a bath mat. Not really interesting, but just a nice dark bath mat. And then I got a matching 
bath like face washer i got some deodorant oh my gosh mm, that is my childhood i got two concealers slay we love our elf concealers over here and then i got some headbands and some toothpaste but yeah that was what i got today i met with the bosses of my job today and i love them they're so cool we went and checked out the venues i'm so excited to start this job and yeah then i went to woolies got some stuff then we went and signed up to the gym we signed up to the gym because we need to do that my room is still a mess like my vanity and stuff is still not done at all but um yeah that's <laughs> a job for another day you know what i mean name is gonna go over so i am gonna be chilling my room by myself tonight i'm gonna do some asr videos so while they're out there doing who knows what i'm gonna be in here whispering to my camera i wonder if they can hear me i wonder if they can hear me that's why i'm talking quiet <laughs> but i'm so happy for naomi because he's a really good guy okay this top name will kill me for saying this right back put these pillowcases on the pillows and see what it looks like okay let's see what these will look like on my bed they're actually gonna look so cute oh, guys if you don't have european pillows get them they're just like massive like like gigantic pillows and i got the 500 thread count i think is what it's called is it thread count is that how you pronounce it but they feel so good too look at it I love it. Okay, they actually almost look shimmery. Okay, I'll show you at the end. I just want to keep talking to you because I've got no one to talk to you tonight. Okay, so my bed obviously isn't made, but this is like the color scheme. And I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it so much. Oh my gosh. Also, I also got LED lights for under my bed. It's like coming off over there, but when they're turned on, it looks so good. But I'll show you that in another vlog because I don't really feel like turning it on right now. But I'll show you that in another book. And then should we go put these in the bathroom as well? Oh, and these. Okay. Okay. So, cute. Okay, cute. That's down there. And then this little hand wash. I don't know where we put hand washers. I guess I'll just like put it here. Cute. Okay, so we actually already have one. But I think this looks cuter. Cute. I reckon they look so cute together. Love, love, love. Okay, I'm really happy with these. Naomi just came in and she approved. She loves them. And they're like so soft. I think it's because they're the 500 count. I don't really know much about that. Like, I don't understand it. But also, guys, I look so bad in this vlog. I look so bad. So, like, I don't want to post it, but I'm just, like, not going to care anymore. Like, I've gained weight. And, like, I've always, I don't know, been so hard on myself. And just, like, not post it because of that. And, like... I'm just like done. I don't care. But I'm so keen now that I joined the gym. I am gonna be getting back on my grind because it has been so long. But yeah, I'm so excited to start weekly vlogging. I'm gonna start weekly vlogging and I'm so excited. Naomi's keen too as well. And so Naomi and I are gonna do like Q and A's and like get to know me stuff and it's gonna be so fun. But yeah, I think I'm gonna like clean up my room a little bit right now. All right, guys, I'm gonna have to finish this vlog on my phone because my camera just died and it's got no like um, it's got no memory storage left either. But it is Monday and I'm about to go and do some babysitting for a friend. But this is my room so far. Mom and dad ended up coming and like dropping off some furniture. So I have this like really cute thing to store stuff on, and then this is like my vanity until I get it at vanity but i found one today that i really like so i messaged a lady about it and hopefully i can get it but it's like my dream one that i want it's like the ikea style one but this is what we've got for now my room is nowhere near done like i'm still i'm going back home today and i'm gonna go grab some more stuff like the final amount of stuff and then i'm gonna like start sorting it out and getting my friends to help like me decorate and stuff like that i've been here for two nights now and i love it it is so good i am feeling so at home it has been such a good move um but yeah i'm gonna make sure i film a room tour by the way i'm talking quiet because it's like 6 a.m and naomi's sleeping and i have to get up early to drive to the town across to do this babysitting job but i'm gonna make sure i film a room tour 
ASAP for you guys so you can like see my new room but as soon as I sort it all out you know get my new desk stuff like that and you guys are gonna see it like first yeah okay thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it was like i feel like it was just me talking a lot i hope that was interesting too i never know if you guys like it's like it's boring if i just like ramble on but then again i feel like that's literally what i love watching so hopefully you guys do too but yeah thank you for watching and i hope you like little random vlogs like this and yeah, i appreciate every single person that watched i'm so happy but, Love you guys and I'll see you in my next video.